morning and I uh, want to just talk to you today about how we hold the golf club. Now, I've been uh, doing lots and lots of putting lessons over the last uh, few weeks and since uh, the last video that we put up, there's a few things that have come to light for me that I think are worth talking about. Now, when you hold a golf club, normally with the full swing, you would, you would hold uh, more towards the fingers through the life, uh, just underneath the lifeline and towards the fat pad and that, that would promote a nice amount of hinge throughout the golf swing. Now, in putting it's slightly different, that we don't really want the hands to be as active through the shot. We don't want any, any sort of release patterns or neither do we want the, the hinge really. We want to try and take that out. So the way we hold the golf club is completely different. So there's, there's my finger grip, there's my palm grip. So the lifeline palm grip going through the center of your, your hand. So this part of your hand here is really, really important because it, it prevents the amount of rotation that we can, we can use within the actual stroke. So just do that again. If I hold it like a normal golf club and then I release out of my fingers into my lifeline, it changes the angle of the putter. Now your putter is designed or is, is uh, being manufactured to set up at roughly 70 degrees. So that's the lie angle of the putter if I just hold on to that. Now, you set up to the putter. The, 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 you, don't, you don't want to take the putter into the ball and you don't want your stroke to revolve around how you work the putter. What you want to do is set your putter up in the direction that you intend to hit the ball and then you approach the putter at the angle that's designed to be set. Now, I, I naturally work into a lifeline grip. Uh, lots of golfers that I see, they, they set and the, the club is in their lap is pointing low into their leg and then the toe end of the putter sticks up. Now I can see this through the cap toe system that I use that the toe angle sits up quite a lot and then when I try and get the, the putter down it's difficult because you can't do that with a finger grip lifting the arms up. So a couple of things that I've done, I've got a shortened alignment stick. I, I like to, to put the alignment stick on the front of the putter and place it into the sternum and by doing that, that also raises the, the handle and it gets you into a nice position where the butt end of the club points towards the sternum as you rotate down, the, the putter feels quite high in the hands. Now, conversely, if you don't use that, I would say we need to try and feel like we're using more of the palm of the hands. By using the palm of the hands there, we can, we're able to get the, the butt end of the club pointing towards the sternum with the right hand applied in, in the same kind of manner. So again, the lifeline of the hand placed onto the side of the handle. You can see that I'm able to point that in towards my sternum and rotating down the shaft and lines perfectly to the forearm. Now, it's a little bit of a, a, little bit of a tip there just to help you set up how the putter's designed to be set up. That helps with strike location, contact, it helps rotate you from a centre turn point from the middle of your body um, and controls the putter place without any hinge or release. Uh, I hope you've enjoyed this video and I look forward to uh, doing some more for you. Cheers.